Hey everyone, this is Kim from Dialogue Partners. I've got a couple of questions for you. What happens when a room is filled with emotion and outrage? What will people say? What will they do? How might we respond? And maybe most importantly, what's the impact that will happen both for the individuals that are in the room as well as our, our public engagement processes overall? I really believe that working with emotion and outrage isn't about getting tough skin or just getting ready to take it, but rather it's about finding, identifying, and working with the opportunities that exist to channel some of the emotion and energy and passion that's in the room. If some of this sounds a bit interesting or maybe even a little bit compelling, I encourage you to uh, check out and join me for When Things Go Sideways, How to Embrace Emotion and Outrage and Change Results. Thanks for listening.